Miami Dolphins. Coming into the world in 1966 and thus making them the youngest franchise in their division, the Dolphins were Florida's first professional team since the Miami Seahawks of the AAFC in 1946. With a very Floridian name and color scheme, the Dolphins have always been able to be one of the more unique teams in the league as no one else in the big four leagues has a color scheme of teal and orange. Sure, plenty of teams have had either of those colors, but not both at the same time. These uniforms were a constant evolution from 1966 to 2012 until a controversial uniform change in 2013. The teal home and white road have always looked spectacular even if they only wore their regular teal once last season. But the biggest controversy is the helmet. It's still a glossy white but the logo was changed. I think it looks fine but I'm not opposed to changing it back. The teal also used to be more on the blue side whereas the 2013 redesign made it more of a greenish teal. In addition Miami was the first team to introduce home and road throw throwbacks before the Giants and Niners would do so later. The teal throwback would debut in 2015 while the white throwback came out in 2019, but honestly it always felt like these have coexisted for the same amount of time. They are both phenomenal recreations of their uniforms from 1966, even down to the helmet, and many argue they should wear these full time. I'm fine with them staying as alternates as overall I think the Dolphins have earned their bump up to decent, though I can't help but think that one day they will return back to their previous logo and maybe go with something else. This concludes the AFC East, tomorrow we'll start the AFC South with a former AFC East team, the Indianapolis Colts.